My name is Vladimir Hovsepian and today I will tell you about the corporate security problem. Who has never dreamed to control computer by fault? Now in 2020 it is possible with brain computer interface. Research on BCI began in the 1970s at University of California. Brain computer interface was conceived to enable people with paralysis and other disabilities to interact with computer or control robotic arms by simply thinking about actions. But starting from 2050, it was widely used for controlling application of playing video games. Two days ago, I bought smart glasses, which give an opportunity to record videos, share photos and other activities by brain-computer interface. These type of devices, as a rule, are programmed to perform only several commands, such as record and share photo or video, answer calls, check emails, and so on. As it turns out, the device that I have bought reads brain waves, which contains personal information. One of threat of this can be loss of confidential information, such as PIN or credit card password captured by the device. By reminding person about credit card, he or she intuitively thinks about password. So it is possible to create program which will recognize credit card with the help of device's camera, and if it detects the password through the brain impulses, it will send it to the third party. So even though technology makes our life easier and more comfortable, at the same time it endangers our privacy and makes us more vulnerable. Anyone can get access to our personal information and even to our mind. And 